Assalamu alaikum students, I am Professor Salma Akhtar. Today, I will take a class on the different changes that occur in cardiac cycle. So these are the changes uh, in cardiac cycle, that is changes in pressure, changes in volume, production of heart sound and production of pulse and also electrocardiogram changes. Now the first point is changes in pressure. In this figure you can see the different changes of uh, different changes in cardiac cycle. So this wave indicates the pressure changes. This is systole and this is diastole. So the pressure changes occur in atria, in ventricle, in aorta and also in the pulmonary artery. So this is another table which shows the pressure changes in aorta and ventricles. So during systole in aorta pressure is increased that is 120 millimeter of mercury and during diastole pressure decreased to 80 millimeter of mercury. In left ventricle pressure in diastole is 121 millimeter of mercury but during diastole it is 0 millimeter of mercury and in the right side that is in right ventricle pressure is less that is 25 millimeter of mercury in systole and 0 millimeter of mercury during diastole. So there are different changes in pressure in different area. This figure also shows the different pressure changes in different area in different circulation you see that in pulmonary circulation pressure is less but in systemic circulation pressure is more systemic circulation starts from the left ventricle and the left ventricular pressure is high uh, that is uh, 120 by 0 that is during systole it is uh, 120 and uh, during diastole it is 0 millimeter of mercury but in aorta pressure is 120 by 80 millimeter mercury that is during diastole it is 80 millimeter of mercury and in systole 120 millimeter of mercury it is the aortic pressure and it this pressure is maintained throughout the arteries we, you know in the meantime you know about the blood pressure and the blood pressure there are different types of blood pressure uh, systolic and diastolic is the important blood pressure that is during systole the maximum pressure during ventricular systole actually late ventricular systole and this is average is 120 millimeter of mercury and during diastole uh, the minimum pressure during ventricular diastole that is left ventricular diastole now the interventricular pressure change you know that the ventricular system has different phases isometric contraction period ejection period so pr pressure is changes in these phases that is in the isometric contraction period pressure increases and maximum ejection period pressure is rises uh, pressure is rising but slowly rise and in the reduced ejection period pressure gradually falls and uh, during uh, diastole in these different phases pressure is changed that is during protodiastolic phase pressure decreasing isometric relaxation period pressure is decreasing in the fast rapid feeling phase pressure decreases slowly slow feeling phase in this time pressure increases that is pressure rises slowly because bl blood is collected here and the last rapid feeling phase pressure rises so these are the uh, pressure changes in the ventricles during systole and diastole and this is the figure showing the pressure changes left ventricular pressure that you see that uh, ventricular pressure increases up to 120 millimeter of mercury during the system and it falls and it falls to 80 millimeter of mercury during 
diastole. It is aortic pressure. It is a ventricular pressure. So it actually the arterial pressure. The aortic pressure represents the arterial pressure. There are three types of volume: end diastolic volume, stroke volume, and end systolic volume. End diastolic volume means the blood volume in the ventricle at the end of diastole and it is about 120 to 140 ml and end systolic volume is the volume of blood that remains in the ventricle after systole ventricular systole and it is about 40 to 70 milliliter and we can calculate the stroke volume by subtracting this end diastolic volume and end systolic volume and it is a 70 to 80 millimeter milliliter per beat that is the volume of blood that is ejected per beat the heart sound another change that occur in the cardiac cycle it is a heart heart sound actually produced due to vibration of the closer of taut valves with vibration of the adjacent blood, walls of heart and the major vessels around the heart during different events of cardiac cycle which conducts through the structure surrounding the heart and then produce the audible sound that is heart sound. So we can hear the heart sound from the surface of chest, chest wall and there are three four types of heart sound first heart sound second heart sound and third heart sound and fourth heart sound actually first and second heart sound is audible by a stethoscope and third and fourth heart sound cannot be audible is that is they are not audible by a stethoscope heart sound can be recorded by phonocardiogram so the first heart sound first heart sound it occurs or it it produced at the beginning of the ventricular system and the characteristics of the first heart sound is low pitched, dull and prolonged. Prolonged means time is 0 0.14 second average time. And the cause of the first heart sound, okay, now see produced at the beginning of ventricular system and it, it is produced due to closer or sudden closer of AV valve. In this time AV valve will be closed suddenly and first heart sound produced that is due to closer of due to sudden closer of AV valves and it indicates that systole of the ventricle starts and it also indicates that closer of the AV valve is properly. And you can hear the first heart sound based in the left fifth intercostal space about half inch inside the mid clavicular line. Now the second heart sound, it is also audible by stethoscope and it occurs at the end of ventricular system. It is high pitched and short duration. Uh, that is average 0.11 second and it is sharp and it like the word da first heart sound la and second heart sound da the cause of this second heart sound is due to sudden closure of semi lunar valve it, it also indicates that ventricular systole is over and the diastole is start that is ventricular diastole begins and a clear uh, second heart sound indicates that the semilunar valves are closing properly. In this figure you can see the second heart sound in this time that is at the beginning of ventricular diastole and after ventricular system. So second heart sound occurred due to sudden closure of semilunar valve. Always correlate the heart sound production of different types of, that is four types of heart sound with the events of cardiac cycle that is cardiac in which event which sound produced
must know and also correlate and you can see this production of the different heart sound in different events by this figure. Third heart sound it is weak. Third and fourth heart sound actually they are weak and uh, they take place due to rush of blood. Third heart sound produced at the middle third of the diastole when AV uh, valve opens and the at the first rapid filling phase in this ta uh, time filling of the ventricle lockers the first rapid filling phase there is much blood uh, sudden that is sudden rush of blood occurs in the ventricle and production of this third heart sound that is it is due to a sudden rush of atrial blood into the ventricle and it it can be recorded in the phonocardiogram and the fourth heart sound same it also uh, it is also known as atrial sound and it is uh, due to contraction of the atria it occurs during atrial system when there is again uh, last rapid filling phase in the uh, ventricle uh, ventricle that is there is again rush of blood into the ventricle and it occurs just before the first heart sound it is also recorded in the phonocardiogram so for fourth heart sound is here fourth heart sound produced due to atrial systole. When atrial systole that is atrial contracts uh, then the last rapid filling phase occur and in this phase there is again rapid rush of blood in the ventricles and produce this fourth heart sound. So these are the heart sound. These are the phonocardiographic recording. First heart sound, second heart sound and third heart sound and before first heart sound it is fourth heart sound. A. A means atria sound. It is the fourth heart sound is also known as atria sound. This is first heart sound, this is second heart sound, this is third heart sound. So these are all about the different changes in cardiac cycle. So thank you very much.